So this is the problem related to torque and the moment of inertia. A fixed 0 0.15 uh, kilogram solid disc pulley. So this is the solid disc pulley having radius 0 0.075 meter is acted on by a net torque of 6.4 meter newton. So what is the angular acceleration of the pulley? So in this problem, the first step we have to find is to find the relevant uh, concept. So uh, relevant concept in this case is torque. and moment of inertia moment of inertia so you also should know the relationship between torque and angular acceleration okay so what are given in the problem is let me write down the given parameters here if you look at here mass is given i can write down mass m is equal to 0 0.15 kilogram and then radius of the pulley uh, let us represent it by r which is 0 0.075 meter is right here and mass is here and what else is given tau right which is torque 6.4 meter newton so these are the three things given in the uh, problem and what is unknown the angular acceleration you know angular acceleration is denoted by alpha and it is what so this is the target variable in this problem okay so to set of equation set of equations so we should be able to find what type of equations we can use to solve this problem so let me write down the equations so first thing is you know if we have tau tau net will be equal to i alpha okay so that I can find alpha from this equation. So alpha will be equal to tau net divided by i, right? But I don't know no i. It is not given. i is moment of inertia. Moment of inertia is not given in this problem. In a state, mass is given and radius is given. If mass is given and radius is given, I can find out i. And the formula is half m r squared this is for moment of calculating moment of inertia for this solid disk right if this disk is solid you know moment of inertia for different shape is different in the case of the solid disk we have to apply this formula half m r squared where m is mass of this disk and r is the radius of this disk right you know the radius so this is the case so these are the formulas we are using to solve this problem and with this we are able to uh, set up this problem okay so now let's go to another page okay okay so uh, now let's do the math this is the third step and easiest step okay so first thing i have to calculate is i which is moment of inertia half m r squared and if i insert all these value mass is 0 0.15 multiplied by 0 0.075 squared and i will get like uh, 4.22 into uh, 10 to the power minus 4 kg meter squared so this is unit of moment of inertia right so this is moment of inertia now second step is the torque the torque tau 
is equal to i alpha and alpha is equal to tau divided by i the tau is given which is uh, from above where it is let me go back and get value of tau tau is equal to 6.4 meter newton let me write it down here 6.4 meter newton uh, divided by uh, 4.22 into 10 to the power minus 4 this is kz meter square okay so if you calculate all these values then you can get alpha which is 1.5 into uh, about 10 to the power 4 rad per second square okay so this is unit of angular acceleration so this is angular acceleration okay so angular acceleration of the uh, solid disk pulley with radius this much and the mass this one uh, when you apply torque the turning force of 6.4 meter newton is this much okay which is 1.5 into 10 to the power 4 rad per second okay